Big win, Don Wilson here for Top MMA News. Here with Nathan Gunn after really, really impressive performance against the always wily Lindsey Hawks. You know, why don't you give us your thoughts on the fight and how it went down for you? I, I think it was a great fight. Uh, it, it opened my eyes, let me stand up, throw my hands after being a little bit hesitant after a couple knockouts and stuff. And uh, he's, a, he's a tough guy. He's coming up from a lighter weight class, but he's, he's a bigger stature yeah. than me. I just, you know, I expect him to be a bit stronger, just being the size that he is. But I, I kind of focused on myself, just making sure that, you know, I'm going to force myself to stand up and throw punches, just yeah. to let myself know mentally that I can take a punch still, you know, can still stand in there and throw him bang. And it was going to be kind of who went down first and fight from there. If I would have known he wasn't out, <laughs> I wouldn't have jumped on top of him. I would have had Eve standing back up. Yeah. But uh, I went down to finish the fight, and he threw me into half guard. And, uh, you know, then the first round kind of played out from yeah. there. But, you know, like I said, it was, it was a good experience for me, just getting that out of the way, letting me know I can take a punch, throw a punch, hit him. Well, you know, I, the, the real big thing made about this fight was you are coming off of two devastating KO losses, more for how they look than, than, than really how they hit you. Um, you know, you, you've got one fight back under your belt now. How do you feel standing and banging? I love it. That's, that's what I love to do. I love to throw punches and get hit. And like I said, I'm not going to lie to you. Everyone thinks wrestling this, wrestling that. And wrestling is a huge asset, and I naturally fight like a wrestler. Mm -hmm. Not necessarily a wrestling trained fighter, but just naturally, I just fight yeah. like a wrestler. If I get you against a cage, I'm tough. I can, I can hold you there. Yeah. I can I can get you in spots where you don't like to be. Um, like my last, well, my last fight, the fight against Spratt, for instance, was in ropes. Yeah. Where if honestly, I still believe that if there wasn't ropes in play and it was a cage, I probably could have won that fight, and he wouldn't have that chance for that shot. So it was impressive performance for you, and at the end of the night, we got a little surprise. Nabil Khatib wins his fight against Showtime Wedderburn at 195 pounds or whatever they were fighting at. Um, and uh, it's announced that you will be taking on the thrill uh, for the Rex inaugural 175-pound or 170-pound title, welterweight title. What do you think about that? It better be 170 yeah. pounds. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think it's going to be an entertaining fight. I think it's going to be... Uh, if I was to make a prediction, I think it should be very similar tonight, but with a little bit more fireworks. Um, I've seen, like, don't get me wrong, I've got a lot of respect for Nabil. The guy's been around for a long time. He's got a lot of talent. He's trained some great guys. He's been some great fights. I've watched him take three-round beating by Ford and some big, big boys. <laughs> And uh, it's going to be a good fight. But like he said, he's a slow starter. I'm a fast starter, like I said in the interview. Yeah. Um, I... I hit hard. People don't realize how hard I hit because they think I'm a wrestler. I just see myself finishing that fight within a round, round and a half. I just, I don't, if he, if, unless he comes out with a lot more than he did tonight, I think it's going to be a great fight. All right, perfect. Well, we won't keep you too long, but uh, it's been Don Wilson with Top MMA News. Do you have anyone else you'd like to thank, sponsors or anything like that? Uh, you know what? I just first of all, my coach Matt Riche and all the boys back at Lean and Gym. Without, like I said, I was a nobody, just a, a brawler fighter, and had an opportunity to get in the cage. And they took me in under their wing, and uh, he basically, like I said, he made me into the guy that I am now. I showed it tonight. You know, Lindsay's a great guy on his back, and he was trying to guillotine, triangle, everything else, yeah. and just stay safe and keep beating. Well, definitely turned you into the man you are right now. You, uh, you know, before the KO losses and get with this win back in there, you're one of the top, uh, you know, prospects rising in Canada in the welterweight division, just outside the top ten. So, you know, we wish you the best of luck. Once again, big win, Don Wilson, Nathan Gunn, top of the news.